and whoop whoop. I'm Matt FX, music supervisor of Broad City, and here's our recap for episodes two and three, Pussyweed and Working Girls. First up, we've got a track called 1977 by Anna Tijoux. 1977 is a very cool Latin rap track running under the cold open of Working Girls. It's a really great identity piece in the show, kind of showing how the two different girls go about their days. Obviously, Alana's a bit of a slacker, Abby's a bit of an overachiever. It's gotten a lot of really great feedback on this track, so we're really happy to feature it in the Signo patente tatuado y en mi frente que en el vientre de mi madre marca pa'l paso siguiente Nacer llorar sin anestesia en la camilla Mi padre solo dijo es Ana María Si sí sería el primer llanto que me probaría que mandó las heridas y tanto Secondly, we're gonna feature a bit about an artist named Hot Sugar uh, Hot Sugar is a producer who's worked with everyone from The Roots to Das Racist He makes incredibly interesting, unique hip-hop beats that have an almost really wonka sort of magic to them He's actually someone who's given us a bunch of music for the show all of which is unreleased so I can't even give you track titles. I can tell you that his music is in a bunch of transitions in episode 3, as well as some of the later episodes in the season. Next up, we've got another feature transition in episode 3 in the instrumental dub of Bad Man by Dr. Jeep. Uh, we feature Bad Man in a transition right before Alana's in the train with the cops. The cops are just walking by while she's a little uncomfortable hiding contraband within her person. Perfect idea to use this track as it starts off with a little siren whoop and having the cops walking by, it just fits real nicely together. Last song featured in this recap is another episode three jam, See You Leave by the inimitable RJD2. See You Leave is running in the dentist waiting room scene as Abby's waiting for Alana to get out of the procedure. Uh, it's a really early scene in our season where we get to show Abby's fun loving side. And I think RJD2's kind of fun, slow, humble groove was just a perfect fit for her personality. up recap for episodes two and three pussyweed and working girls thanks so much for watching follow me on twitter at matt fx 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 four times if you have any questions about the music on the show follow broad city on facebook tumblr or twitter and we'll see you next week four and three and two and one, one.